Hey everyone, Case here. Welcome back to the Star Wars event. General Hux is the next character that I have to cross off my list and it is ready to go. And there will be two more other things as well in this video, so stay tuned for that. Oh yeah, by the way, once you do get all the items, there is a six hour wait time. Perfect screenshot. To your post, troopers, weapons at the ready, and prepare to mobilize. If the resistance thought that we would evacuate this region permanently, they're as foolish as they are cowardly. The First Order is implacable and it does not surrender. Hiya! And there's Hux right on cue. You all good on your part of the plan, buddy? Yep. My guys and I find some place to ride some speeders of our own. Well, you hit the first order's tread speeder base. And if Hux's ego is as big as I think it is, I'll have ordered some of the troops there to guard him instead of the bikes. It'll be tight, but that should give me enough of an opening to infiltrate through a supply garage without anyone catching on. Hey, if anyone could do it, you can. Good luck out there. Not that you're gonna need it. Poe has to raid the tread speeder base garage, and Finn arrange for a speeder drop off points. Nothing about General Hux, though. In terms of General Hux, though, we have to get two more of the First Order Emblem. I'm assuming we're going to have to obviously upgrade this character, so let's do that first. I'm so glad I can help. Hey, you can put a cork in that one. There's two. Well, hello again, old friend. Nice to see you back. Well, now you have a quest. In Phasma's absence, it falls to me to be seen among the troops, to inspire them as they bring the galaxy to heal. And I will surpass her. Given what I know about Phasma's true nature, it will not be difficult. I can outlast her, just as I'll last all the others. And spot the troops. For the four hour course, we've also got Code Enforcement, which drops a token, Ensure Order, Report for Duty, Confront Enemies, Enact Code Enforcements, Audit the Base, Make Yourself Known, Oversee Operations, What the Hux, Revoke Flight Clearance, Destructive Conversations, Discuss tactics, do your job, challenge rivals, check for illegal cargo, refuse to hold, attempt to take over, optimize process, and locate the resistance. How many was that? That felt like it went on forever. Let's count. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. Oh, there's only 20. It felt like there was more than that. Let's do this first. We've got a six hour quest. And then we got a four hour quest. I'm assuming that after we do that, then I can actually build the resistance speeders. Now let's do some clearing while I'm here. We have the spiders that are back too. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now remember in the beginning I said there are two more other things that I'm going to do. Let me show you those two things. The first one is going to be a certain thing that's kind of golden. Make that really golden. 
Just a matter of locating it. Wow, this is really, really laggy. That's the wrong golden trophy! Oh, I just gave it away. You had to rank in the top 50, which is actually pretty difficult, especially if you don't have all the characters. In this case, you needed all the Wreck and Ralph characters to really help you and boost you forward. Clearly, I'm going to put this in the Star Wars area. And we'll place this, I guess we'll place it right here, next to my blue lightsaber stand. Look at that, looks great, doesn't it? Normally I'll put it where all my other trophies are, but again, because it's Star Wars related, I gotta place it here. What about the third thing? It is the Resistant X Wing. Yep, for 150 gems, I am going to place this down, definitely. There's also the Resistant Speeders right there, which again, I'll be able to get that probably pretty soon. Construction time's only two hours? Sweet! This of course is instant. Not doing this for the token, just doing it because it looks really cool. Let's do it. What? What is happening? No, no, go back in. That was so cool. Go back in. You know you want to. They're taking pictures of it and everything, as they should. I don't think you're going back in, but we got a chance to see that really, really quickly. I wonder if that does the same thing if someone goes to it as well. But either way, that absolutely made my day because that was totally unexpected. Oh, I can also upgrade it as well if I choose. I don't know. I have to see which of these particular buildings the characters go in the most. So I'll do that, I guess, in my off time. But that is all three items. General Hux. The Star Wars Event Trophy. And the Resistance X-Wing Building. Eventually, I will have to get to the point to welcome Ray, which will be in four and a half days after recording of this video. So I just have to make sure I get to the point that says, welcome Ray, within the four and a half days, and then I will be sitting pretty there's a lot of time remaining, which means there's a lot of stuff we probably have to get done, i.e. Put down this building here, and of course, probably upgrade a lot of the characters. I don't know what else we gotta do. A bunch of things, I'm sure. Moving forward in the Star Wars event. So thank you everybody so much for watching, and I will see you on the next one. Bye-bye, everybody.